Tick. Cut, 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 cut. Fahima, can we please just get some adjustments there? The lighting, it works, I think. You, number three, yeah, move, please. That, this is, no, no. Where is my coffee? Where is my coffee? My machtag, man. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, H and Nine and Rose Cake. Putting a music video together is no child's play. I'm giving you guys a behind the scenes look on what exactly happens when we're putting a music video together. Oh, 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 hey, Oh, do you need a little coffee? I thought I'd bring you one. Oh, thank you so much. Actually, from, you know, the Kyle Lewis. Well, I'm the one. <laughs> okay, so Kyle, I see you've got a lot of work when it comes to directing. What is the role of a director on set? I mean, the role of the director, I think, for, you know, it's different for every every set. I like to be quite involved. I like to do a little bit of art direction, a little bit of styling and things like that. But the role of a director is to kind of, like, keep the ship going. It's, you know, everybody needs to answer to someone, so I'll get asked the lighting and the acting. So it's a little bit, I wouldn't say the boss, I think the producer is mostly the boss. Because the producer will tell me no, and tell me what I can and cannot have. But when it comes to a director, you know, you have to have the confidence and the, and the kind of know-how to kind of control a set and make sure everything runs smoothly and you get beautiful shots at the end of the day. So Kyle, you're pushing the envelope when it comes to rap music in South Africa, rap music videos specifically in South Africa. Can you tell us what was the very first music video you have ever worked on? The very, very first music video I ever did was actually for Lockenville, Sun in My Pockets, that like hit back Lekker. in the day. Never thought it was going to be as big as what it was, but I was still in film school when I shot it. We shot it for basically no money. Could have been better if I shot it now, but you know, it's one of those things that kind of started off the kind of chain of my career. So what tips do you have for aspiring musicians like myself, you know, that want to shoot their very own music videos? What tips do you have for us? You know, I think the best thing to do is just shoot, shoot, shoot as much as you can. It doesn't have to be these high-end cameras that we're using. It can be on a cell phone, it can be on a GoPro. It can be just to get as much experience as possible. Because when I started, I knew nothing. You know, I came into this just like anybody else on the street. So it's just about consistently working at it and working at your craft. And for young filmmakers, like, it's, it's not undoable. You know, it's not, you know, you can go out, you can shoot, you can do these kind of things, and you can be a film director if that's what your passion is. What drew you to the rap hip hop? Genre. I've always, since I was a young child, I've uh, really enjoyed hip hop and rap and stuff. So it was always a natural progression for me as a director. Also, the artists in the rap game are very willing to push style and, and, and visuals and things like that. So that's really why I kind of fell into it because you know I could really flex my creative muscle when it comes to kind of rap artists and hip hop artists. So tell us a bit about the music videos that influenced your work today. Basically anything by Hype Williams back in the day, you know, the stuff he did with Missy Elliott was some of my favorite work ever, yeah. So Carl, can you give us like tips on how to like shoot our very own music video? Yeah, you know, like you can, there's so many ways that you can do things without spending money. Kind of thinking out the box is yeah. the best way to do it, you know, you don't necessarily need, again, you don't need film lights. You can go to Chinatown, you can get little fairy lights or anything like that and you can kind of put that together and create your own shots. And you'll find at the end of the day you can create something really beautiful with not having to spend a lot, a of, lot money. of money. Yeah, yeah. You do want to stay tuned because next up we speak to the artist behind the video. You will do me, I think. Hectic. <laughs>